hello good evening welcome to our youtube channel welcome to our youtube channel thank you for stopping by i really do appreciate you thank you so much please if you haven't subscribed what are you waiting for if you have subscribed i'm so grateful thank you so much um this evening i want to talk about how one very powerful natural um nature that can help you boost sales in your business but before we go into that i want to tell you why spiritual work don't work for some persons now someone else may use um a particular product or prepare something and then introduce you to it they introduce you to it sorry they introduce you to it because it works for them right but when they introduce you to it you realize that it doesn't work for you and you begin to wonder why is it that it doesn't, spiritual work don't work for me i get to hear some persons that will come and meet me oh um, spiritual work doesn't work for me spiritual products don't work for me and all that no matter what or who prepare it it doesn't work for them according to them I said, well, I don't know about that personally. You understand what I mean that, but I don't know about that personally. I cannot talk about you as an individual. You understand? But today I want to tell you one very major reason why spiritual work don't work for some persons. Immediately, someone, um, there are some persons, immediately they touch a product. Because of what is in them, because of the negative energy or something, whatever that is in them, immediately they lay their hands on that product. It dispowers the product. Yes, there are people like that. So, that is why I always emphasize on at least start doing some little cleansings that will get to you, that you can afford around you. Start doing them before maybe you order any spiritual products anywhere or before you prepare the major spiritual products like the soap and other things you understand now if you are into production of uh, spiritual things how to make them the soap and all that you should know there is a way there is a way to charge that um, product you're giving to anyone that's in such a way that anyone that touches it eh, no matter what they carry in them it will not neutralize it now i don't want um, anyone coming to ask me how do you charge it if you are making it as a business no this is is my own your business listing so i am not uh, going to divulge it but the reason why i am putting it out is so that some persons don't go about saying spiritual things don't work for them because they bought it from someone or because they prepared it themselves they say ah, no matter what who, who prepared it it because there are some things in you that immediately you touch that product it becomes powerless now the things in you that makes it powerless is not that they are it's good things no they are negative things in you so that is why start cleansing yourself little with looted things before you do the main spiritual um cleansing or pro touch the main spiritual products that is why also we give um these products to dispatch riders we we build them out of the country and all that so if you're someone that is producing spiritual things if you don't know how to charge it in such a way that whoever touches it whatever they carry in them can never destroy the power that is very important thank you so i want to talk about um how you can use the rain water and salt thank god by the grace of god the rain is still ahead so this one, no one will say, oh, Gloria, rainy season has passed and that. If you are a business person, a business person with physical shop, now it just is not just, I'll come to how you can also use it for yourself. I have a video on the channel on how you can use the rainwater, honey, and coconut water to bless yourself. I will link it to, with this video. But now what we're talking about is how you can use it to make sales in your area of business, especially if you're having a physical shop get rainwater direct from the sky not from um, the one that you get from not the one that drops from a building into the bucket of water you understand no direct from the sky get that and then get um salt 
you understand get that and get salt add some salt inside the rainwater when you go to your shop use it to sprinkle on your goods sprinkle it on your goods and also you can use it to wash your store maybe the front of your store or to wash your store anyhow you understand sprinkle it on your goods use it to wash your store down even if you are selling on the road it's just that you know people will judge you so you just need to be careful they'll be wondering what is this water she's bringing every day now you see some people come with some water and that maybe it's rain water you wouldn't know so if you're selling on the road where people will see you so you don't you just have to be careful before they begin to tell you uh she's putting in you know you know they had they go begin hard then go give you name you understand so use it to sweep the rain water and salt use it to sweep down your store thank god we are not buying rain water it's natural gift from god almighty so no one will say our rain water is going to get expensive no then the second way you can use on that same rainwater and salt. Okay, sorry. If you do that, if you're a business person with a physical shop, physical goods, not online. I'm not saying now, online, this is how you can also use it. By the time you use it to sprinkle your shop or your goods or sweep out your, um, wash down your shop. Yeah? People go begin to say, wait till she they use oh, till she juju, she don't do juju, no mind them. <laughs> then you can also use it to have your beds, rainwater and salt. Oh my goodness. Now you can use that one to have a cleansing bath. That one is a cleansing bath. Use it to see that is one powerful cleansing bath again. Use it to have your bed i know some people will begin to ask me what if i if it's too cold can i boil it no just leave it in its natural form the way it is and make sure it's dropped direct from the sky into your bucket or container you understand then if you want to use it to have um, a blessing and sweetening bath you get the rain water add some salt and then add um what's it called honey yes hard honey maybe a spoon or spoon a spoon or two spoon of honey to eat and use it to have a sweetening and blessing bath now what is a sweetening and blessing bath a bath you have and bless and pray bless and pray for goodness and favor into your life by the grace of god now i would advise if you want to do this first and foremost use the rainwater and salt to have a only the rainwater and salt to have a cleansing bath first huh? then you get another one Add the rainwater and salt. I know I will have questions like, is it going to be uh, rock salt, sea salt, harmonia salt, uh, native salt, or whichever, whichever salt you have. Salt is a very, very, very powerful element and blessing to mankind from God Almighty. So, oh my goodness, I don't know, God just bless mankind with salt, only for you to find out its uses, how you can use it, then you are blessed. So, when you are done having a cleansing bath first with the rainwater and salt, with the rainwater and salt mixture, then you get another um, rainwater again and add salt again into it. Also, um, add the honey, you understand? I use it to have a sweetening and blessing bath. Let's take advantage of the rainy season. Any way this season, we will use them. Now, if that season don't pass, we will look for another thing. God has really blessed us with nature. When you try this rainwater and salt, or rainwater and honey, or rainwater in your business as a business person, to God be the glory. You'll be thanking God. People may be thinking, ah, you they do, ah, see the way people are. That is the secret of some people. You see, they go gather for their shop. Ah, you go there like this, they look and be asking, ah, what is happening? Am I the only one? Did I offend my village people? No. Some people know the secret of nature. So try this method and give God the glory. We are waiting for rainy season. Rain should start. Oh, rain, rain, rain should start. Oh, rain, rain, rain should start. Oh. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate you. It's no other person but Gloria Cheesy. Oh, thank you.